Okay guys, our weather's getting kind of bad here, so we're going to try to rush this last test in. This is the Hornady Critical Defense, and we're looking at the 115 grain FTX bullet. This is kind of uh, an interesting load. This is also the same as the um, uh, the Zombie Max 124, 115 grain. So let's go ahead and shoot her and see how she does. We're going through four layers of denim and we're going into jugs of water. All right, guys, we've got one, two, three, and then look what we found on the outside of the outside of the third jug right there. Let's uh, set it back up and I'll show you what happened. This is the uh, Horner D Critical Defense, the FTX bullet, and uh, it went through three jugs and, and ended up between the third and the fourth jug on the table. As you can see, really uniformed expansion. Here's the uh, little polymer tip that uh, we took out of it, right there. And that uh, deforms and expands out the petals. You can see that most of that bullet is still quite intact. No jacket, jacket separation, really. Not a lot of expansion, but uh, through three, three jugs, it's pretty good penetration. And that's through four layers of denim as well, so. There's the critical defense at its widest point. We're looking at 0.518 inches of expansion. Not the most impressive uh, expansion I've seen, but uh, I have noticed uh, from all the uh, from all the testing that I've done with the critical defense and and the Hornady uh, Zombie Max, which is essentially the same bullet. Uh, they've all been reliable openers. Here is the polymer tip. I'll stick that right on the right in the center there so you can see the polymer tip. There's the polymer tip in it. Goes right in the right in the center there. Uh, so yeah, I mean very 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 uh, controlled expansion. Um, I've not seen one of these not open. So they're pretty impressive that way, pretty reliable. Uh, the penetration, you know, um, is a little iffy on these rounds, being that they're a little bit lighter and a little bit slower. Um, I'm going to put the information uh, for the specs of this round and what I and the data I gathered down at the bottom. Anyway, you'll have to tell me if, what you guys think and if you are, are excited about this round or not. I'm kind of uh, lukewarm to this round, just because it's a little bit slower. My uh, data came in at 299 foot-pounds of energy, um, and the expansion was not the most impressive. So. Uh, overall, I think it's a quality hollow point. Um, I just don't know if it's going to be uh, the carry load for me. So, all right, guys, uh, let me know what you think. Leave a comment down below. Uh, rate the video as well, like or dislike, however you see fit. And uh, thank you guys very much for watching, and we will talk to you guys later. See ya.